Good morning, I'm Teresa Shaw, and thank you for joining me for devotions this morning. Today, we celebrate Martin Luther King. And of course, Martin Luther King was a wonderful leader and who I believe that God sent to us to lead us and to help us to see that God wants all of us to work together, to love each other, and to be in peace today. So my devotions today is around promoting peace. And that is something that Dr. Martin Luther King always talked about, peace. He also said, for all people. And that's what Christ always says. Everything he says is not for certain people, it's for all people. And so that's what Dr. Martin Luther King stood for. That's what he fought for until his death. And he leaves us a wonderful legacy of God's work through a young man such as he. And as we talk about being thankful, I don't know about you, but I am thankful that Dr. Martin Luther King came our way. Well, when you look at promoting peace, I look at Proverbs 12, 20. And it says, those who promote peace have joy. If you recall Dr. Martin Luther King's last speech that he said, mine eyes have seen the glory. And he said that he had been to the mountaintop. To me, that is peace. That is peace from the heart through all of his hard work and through his challenges in life, he was thankful and he had peace. How many of us can say that today? That we have peace in all that we do and all that we say and the work that we do for Jesus Christ. You know, when I talk to our father, I know that the beginning of each new day, I have a choice to make, whether to live in peace, to live in anger, to have hostility against others, but I choose peace. And I have found that peace gives me joy. I also choose thanksgiving. And remember, that's what we're working on and we've talked about. Rather than asking, being thankful for. And so every morning that you get up, the first thing that you should do is to thank God for just all the wonderful things, even just one small thing. Thank God. And the number one thing, that, in case you can't think of anything, would be, God, I thank you for getting me up this morning. And regardless of the challenges of the day and all that you're facing in your life, God will help you see it through. And he also says he wants us to help others to see that love and that peace. And so we are to share it with our neighbors, people that we see in the community. That is what we as Christians should be doing. And we ask that God gives us the courage and the determination to extend peace and joy to others. 
So I leave you today from our devotions with the promise of peace and joy. However, it has to come from us. And so I'm thankful that God has given me the peace and the joy of just knowing that he is there with me always. I hope you will have a good week and remember that God is in control and he wants you to share your love and promote peace and joy. I hope to see you again next week.